All right, time for some more still game and well, season five, episode two, we've got what season five, season six, seven is where it starts to take and get a little bit dicey as far as uploading. So we got, we got what, five more episodes with this season, six more episodes with this season right here. And I think seven episodes of season six, we still got a little bit, you know, absolutely love this show. Absolutely love this show. And just a absolute hilarity that happens. Let's go on ahead and see what the gang has got in store for us uh, these next two episodes, shall we? Steady. I have for you. Okay, don't kick him in the toe. Look at that, that dirty, miserable bastards. Oh, aye, aye. It's all about saving money, you see. We low dingy lights cheap. Uh, see, that's no safe, is it? Having pensioners creeping about in a half light trying to get in and out their houses, you know. Right, let's have a look, see what we've got here. Uh, 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 Seems like oh, a flashlight might have been a good idea. Uh, there you see. 25 watts. Uh, what's that? Do <laughs> <laughs> you bastard snug hood? Flashlight, well, homie, flashlight. I'm offering it to you. Right, where's your horn? That's my face! Aye, sorry. Right, look, take the old bulb. To me. Right. Oh, shit. <laughs> Is that a good bulb or a shitey bulb? It's a shitey bulb. Here's a good bulb. Oh, right, aye. Go with that. Right. Oh. God <laughs> dang! Right. Got a floodlight. No too bright, is it? No, 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 not at all. It's safe as what it is. Aye, aye, it's safe, aye. <laughs> <laughs> They'll run into a wall. <laughs> Why are you telling back? It's, it's probably a little bit dangerous to go, you know, to something as bright as that. Because you go from dingy light, not being able to hardly see, but that, that poses a hazard. But then again, you got people running into walls now, like Jack. Jesus Christ. It looked like this, somebody turned on the sun on, in the uh, hallway there. <laughs> Who are you? Time to bloody call us anyway. Can I see my watch for the glare? It's 12 o'clock, you cheeky bastard. Here, where's our post? I was in this building at half eight this morning with a post. You two didn't have any. I'm done for the day. I just come up to see Isa. Oh, thank God. My goodness. What's going on? Have I died? <laughs> right, Isa dolls. That was a great day. Aye, uh, see you, darling. Yeah, where'd you get the bulb, boys? Wembley. <laughs> Shut up, yeah, it's, uh, the beads. Ah. <laughs> that bandy. Um, aye, that's a fella. Dave, what is it Chris is doing for you, anyway? Oh, he's just, eh, uh, going to decorate my living room. Eh? Hey? He's a posty. And a shitey one at that. No, he says he was a decorator before he became a posty. Right. And what's he wanting off you for that? He's going to paper the living room and paint it now for 160. Eh? Hey, aye, and that includes the paper and paint? No, I have to get the paper and paint now. I can't wait for Christ's sake. Tell him he sling his bloody hook. Aye, right, Jack's right. You do not want that shiftless bastard floating about your house, in your fridge. Oh, aye, in your cupboards and your wardrobe and your, your knicker drawer and that and going through. 160 to wallpaper and paint. And you provide the wallpaper. Like, it's not a bad deal to be honest with you. At least nowadays it isn't. God dang, now you looking at three hundred dollars just for consultation fee. Your smalls and that's plenty, Jack. Uh. <laughs> we'll do it for you. Oh, how much? Oh no, we're not charging anything. No, 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 no. Just to uh, make sure there's plenty for eating and I right, we'll, we'll blast through it. Oh, are you sure? Aye, for God's sake. What are neighbours for? Two handymen on your doorstep. A pleasure, Donna. Oh Suppose. Lord! This is not going to go well. I can Chris see. It's a wank. Take them forever. <laughs> I like Chris. Ah, well, that's what you say to him then. Say, Chris, I like you. I've always liked you. You're likable. Oh, but Jack and Victor, they think you're a wanker. So you'll not be doing any painting. Uh, I'm a bit like something myself. Mm. Right, you come out, and you go in. Ah. That's more like it, eh? 
Man, yeah. there's less light than the first one. Bobby. <laughs> Aye. Can we put a film on? Aye, on you go, on the top shelf through the back, yeah. Pretty far, is it? I'm getting these. Not at all, no. Two lager and a sherry, Bobby, and don't take their money. Godfather one or two. Let's get on here. They're putting a film on. Oh, magic. That'll make a nice change. I know the Godfather, but I knew it was you, Fredo. Bang, boom, deed, shite. <laughs> Eyes are buying your drink for you now. That's a new low even for you two. Shut your hole, Bobby. We're doing her a favour. Jaws! No, big stupid rubber shark. Garbage! What are you doing for her? Painting and decorating. <laughs> you two halfwits. Let's hear shite new, Bobby. <laughs> One flew over a cuckoo's nest. You might see a bunch of dafties escaping out of loony bin. Come back here at shutting time. Use <laughs> <laughs> two cans of fusilier, Bobby, will you? Yeah, uh, right, old shug. Uh, I'm off. Are you in your night shift, is it? Aye. Pain in the arse. How's that? A pain in the ass. Big department store out of your cell. Oh, you're, you're just sitting in an office watching the telly, trying to stay awake. I'd love to be in there at night. Here, do they allow visitors? No, really. Listen, I'll get a couple of cans as well and I'll come down and keep you company. Oh, no. You'd be bored out of your tits. No, give yourself peace. It'll be a good laugh. Winston, of course, he's always looking for something to do. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Go one, sir. Aye, aye, I've got one. It's a good one, too. It's a cracker. Police Academy uh -oh. 8. Mission to Moscow. Whoa. Hey! I'm not needing a big issue, son. That's a map of the store. <laughs> map of the bloody store. Get a grip, son. It's a shop, not a mountain range. Where are we? <laughs> Bro, I hate that about Lowe's. Like, you go in and you, it, you... They might have what's supposed to be on the aisle at the end of the aisles. But where at on that aisle... And finding the aisle that you need are two entirely different things. We need them. Ten layers of vinyl silk emulsion, dusky blue. I'm tied in here. Mm. I'm seeing. I, I've I've got to shoot. Like I've got to take and cut this uh, big old booger down because Lord have mercy, everything getting caught in it again. Drama four. It's everything required in the one tool. It saws, it drills, it routes, it jigs, it hammers. To collect your pension for you know, does it? <laughs> Jack! <laughs> Imagine a fiddly job. Something like a letterbox in the door. Normally that would require a drill, a coping saw, a hacksaw, a file. But with a dramal, you're in and away and finished in a matter of seconds. Don't just take my word for it. You, sir. There you go. Are you right or left-handed? Oh, no, you're asking a mouthful there, son. <clears throat> now, ordinarily, if I'm hammering or sawing, I use the right hand. But I've seen me with pliers in my left hand, then switching to my right when this hand gets sore. Forget this. You give me a pen, away I go, nice as you like with the right hand, but Jack here will tell you if I'm doing a crossword, huh? a crossword, I use my left hand, because it's all capitals. <laughs> He's got the poor fella all confused now. Thank you. Here, switch it to drill. Yeah, drill. Nice action. That's your pilot hole. Good. Switch to saw. Saw. And off you go. Yeah. Here, Jack, boy. This is the ballast. <laughs> I got blast of you. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. Wait. Oh, Let's good see lord. What you're all about. I'm hot. <laughs> Is it okay to take my t shirt off? <laughs> Aye. Oh, wow. <laughs> Tiffany, you've got great tits. <laughs> oh, no. Cracking in now, Bobby's home <laughs> movie. I'd be right into them. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, mid-pong. Who's that? I'll get it. 
Hello, just to let you know, your lawnmower's not working. Who are you? I'm Troy, the gardener. Oh. You're no Troy the gardener. You're Bobby the barman. That's me back. Oh, no. <laughs> About to say, that's all he needs. If we wait here forever, then that boy's gonna be okay. Oh, aye. Aye, he'll be fine. It's only a bloody thumb. They just pack it nice, then they stick it on later, you know? Come back to Monday. Aye. Aye. Here is this boy. Aye, here we go. Oh, aye. Excuse me, son. We've uh, been waiting here a wee while. We're wanting paint. You need the paint guy to get you paint. I'm carpet. I can only get you carpet. Fine. Where is the paint guy? Might be on his tea or something. Yeah, the other paint guy, he'll be floating about somewhere. Excuse me, son. I'm laminated flooring. <laughs> there are two customers hanging about like a couple of spare pricks for the paint guy. The carpet arsehole was unable to assist because the shiftless bastard knows hee-haw about pain. Hey, was he bastard? Let me see all that shite into a microphone. <laughs> Take a walk around here and get that big fat baldy bastard with a tool belt. See if that dick will help us. Oh, Bro, they're gonna get kicked out. Shoving. You all right, son? Oh, all right. <laughs> Hello? Anybody there? J just, just a second. Uh, I'm in a hurry here. Just a second. <laughs> well, can I leave you the money? Listen here, Mina's not here. I'm running off my feet. I'm trying to attend to an urgent matter in the back shop. Give me a goddamn minute. <laughs> right. <laughs> I put my to deposit. I have paused it. <laughs> wait, wait. <laughs> Look at his ass. <laughs> Don't ever know like a jackhammer. Joy the gardener, huh? You dirty bastard. Go on, Bobby, son. Oh, she's a bit of all right, isn't she? Aye, she was. She comes in the shop. She's a big fat cow now. This was for ages ago. Right, fine. I'm off to Coley's. Aye, that's what to do, love. Knock yourself out. Not she losing a customer. Oh, it's only money. <laughs> In the way, woo woo! <laughs> Gotta go hop along, Cassidy. <laughs> Jesus Christ, that is massive. This is too good. Here, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to go back to that perfume department and try on all these fancy aftershaves. Maybe even have a shave with an electric razor. Then I jaunt out to the suits, aye. Try on all the expensive clothes. A good half hour fannying about in the toy department and a rummage about with the hi-fis, culminating in a one hour kip in the king of all beds, the Sealy Posture Pedic. Is that so? What's this? This is it. This is my work. Oh, you're joking. You've got a world of entertainment out there. Oh, aye, a world of security cameras and recording equipment. Look, I warned you it might be boring. Out there's a no-go. <sighs> Bloody company, man. Look, if you want to go... No, I said I would keep you company, and I am nothing if not a man who keeps his word. Delaney security. What? All right. It's for you. Uh oh. Hello. Uh huh. Hmm. Hmm. I see. Understood. Shug, you're on your own. <laughs> Tam's got a porn tape with Bobby the barman in it. <laughs> That was a quick change of heart. Are you going to buy a paint or are you just going to stand there? Just standing here. The fact's all right. 
What are you waiting for? Nothing. So, you come into the pub and you don't want a drink? That's right. Give two pints of lager, Bobby. Derek, he knows how it works. You're here. Have you got it? Is it right enough? It's right enough. It's a belter. Here, get that in your pocket. Right, I'll get a pint down the road. Pint nothing! <clears throat> Get up the road, get that in your machine, get it watched and get it back to me first thing tomorrow morning. Jack and Victor still haven't seen it yet. Don't you? Oh dear God, they're passing it around. Here we go, two pints. Usual Winston. Ah, uh, usual Winston, you maddie. <laughs> <laughs> Winston gonna break it, I can see it Who's now. What doing? Shagged it, Bobby. Shagged it. It's not that. I've got my garden today tomorrow as well. Mm -hmm. It's a chew up. Aye. You see, what I need is a gardener. But oh, no. That's the problem, isn't it? Where do you find it? it see, if you're going to take and do something like this, you kind of keep it on the low low until everybody's seen it. Then you all crack the jokes at them. That's how it's supposed to wait. You're going to blow it. You're going to blow it? I can see it now. Winston, come on now. And a gardener in Craig Lang. Oh, there used to be one. Uh, Roy, I think his name was. Roy. Roy the gardener. If it wasn't he, Roy, it was something very like Roy. Come on, give us a pie, Bobby. Aye, uh, give us a minute, I'll stick one in. <laughs> Two for Jack. Two for Victor. Bro. Three each. Blazes. You got it? I've got it. Right. Oh, oh, Jesus. Sorry. Oh, no! What are you doing? Well, you've not got a pacing table, so we're just going to use your front door. Oh, no. No, this isn't what I had in mind at all. You can't do that. The big jagger box will tear all my paper. Aye. We'll screw that off and all. Oh no, I don't know. Calm down, eyes a hen. It'll be fine. Can I do anything? Yes, you can get to your work. Go on, chase yourself. You're only getting under your feet anyway, darling. Go on. Oh, here. Oh, Isa. Here, I'm going to think she's in for the best thing. I can leave you the number. Well, no need you. Go on, get. Hang up. I've got pies oh, in it. Oh, Isa! Hey, that you? Right. Okay, okay. I'm up. Let's see. Let's point to this. Why are they going to ruin this so I can see it now? <laughs> <laughs> she should be charging them money at this point. Uh. Pies in, Vic boy. Any danger? Jack, Victor, the inn. Winston, we're in here. Oh, I see you. Right, Jack, sit down. Victor, you sit there. So poor Isaac goes to work and they're, they're going to bring over, oh, this poor lady. They're going to have mismatched everything. What's going on? Eric? You're not going to believe this? Silence, Tam. There are no words needed to describe this. This truly speaks for itself. It's a porno movie. Wait, wait, keep watching. <laughs> Turn that off, Winston. Easy. Steady. I'll get it. It's coming. Hello. Just to let you know. <laughs> I was going to bring this with me last night, but I watched it three times already. 
The plot's a bit thin, but there's a lot of action. <laughs> <laughs> Here's my thing. How are you going to joke with someone, even if they're the, the bartender, being in a dirty movie? They got the action. Just saying. Are Jack and Victor good at that sort of thing? Aye. They would now offer other advice. I suppose. I could have done it for you. You? Do you do DIY? Who do you think keeps this place running like a Swiss watch when anything goes wrong? I don't want to go here. A plunger like your outfit, so steady band. Anyway, it's Chris I'm worried about. Aye, you got to break it to him that he's no doing it. Aye, I feel bad. What will I say to him? Well, what can you say, Isa? You promised him the job, then you give it to somebody else. Your word is not your bond. You lied. You stabbed him in the back. Stop it, Navid. Aye, I'll just keep it his road. Aye, that's what they do. Might be difficult, that though. How? Because he's standing right behind you. <laughs> oh, no! Well, what do you make of that? There's probably no use of going that tape. Aye, aye, but it's him that gave me it and told me to go and show everybody in Craig Lang it. Of course he doesn't know I've got it. <laughs> I'll have to do it in his stockroom. How old is that? We think it'll be ten years. <laughs> Are you not supposed to have a big wallop to be in these sort of movies? Aye. It's just a daft wee piece he's got, eh? Mind <laughs> <laughs> you, he was busy with it. <laughs> I know that, but I mean, how does it come to pass that you end up in one of the porno movies? I don't know. Probably an advert in the back of your paper somewhere. <laughs> oh, aye, that's right, aye. Wanted men for pumping women. <laughs> Must be dirty bastards. <laughs> I'll not be able to look him in the eye again. <laughs> or eat his pies. <laughs> <laughs> Right, you lot, shoot, we've got one to be getting on. <laughs> so, uh, who's all seen it? Oh, they're going to leave Navid, the tape. You oh, no. Us. You putting it back? No, oh, I'll be taking it right back via the bookies and Big Arthurs. <laughs> <laughs> and them Delsa bands will look at it. Here, don't forget Shug. He's screaming out for it. Uh, Shug, too, of course. Here, come here a minute. That's not right, is it? Mm. Well, that's just a washer. Well, that's not a washer. No, no. That just needs tightening. Keep a twist, Jack. Uh -oh. I said twist it, no pull it, you dafty. I need a bloody twist. Right. Out my road. Well, it's no big deal, that. <coughs> well, I see all that there. That's just a coupling. It's just came uncoupled. Eh? Well done, eh? Good for you. Panic merchants. 35 year of Clyde Fitter. <laughs> you see, the one thing you have to remember about pipes, especially in buildings like this, is that you've been... <laughs> <laughs> that blink sound as it hit him in the forehead. You wouldn't have seen them. They were like the three stooges. <laughs> we high killed it out of oh, That's funny, eh? Oh, right, 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 right. What about this tape? Uh-huh. <clears throat> OK. There we are. Is it good? Oh, aye. I, I, and is it Bobby right enough? Oh, that's Bobby, all right. It's all Bobby. It's full of booby! <laughs> I'm going to watch it the minute I get to my work. I'm bursting to see it. <laughs> bursting to see what? The chariots of fire. Chug, has you seen that, have you, Chug? Uh, no, no. But I'm um, bursting to see it. Chariots of fire? Ah, well, I, I love all that stuff, you know, uh, Romans and horses and chariots. I love that Charlton Heston. All right. <laughs> Good night. Oh, pint, sir. Yes, I'll have another pint, please, Troy. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. So it's Tam. Did you call me? Gonna... Bobby? <laughs> no, you called me, Troy. <laughs> Did that? Uh -oh. Where's my tape? What tape? My pond! <laughs> my <pen> tape. Shugs <laughs> go to. Hey, Isa. Sherry Bobby. Uh, you're going to have to look after the bar for Hoff and her, darling. Aye, aye, okay. 
Booby. Timmy, come on, Booby. Uh oh. Uh oh. Hey, Eric, what's going on? Believe me, Isa, you don't want to know. It's a man's thing. Oh, is it Booby's pardon tape? <laughs> <laughs> you know about that? Hi, I seen that years ago. Connie Jackson used to clean in here. She snuck it out. We used to watch it at parties. Sorry, Eric, it's old news. Oh, wow. What you after? Um, Lager love. It's a sin that you come in here after you work for a sherry and end up working again. Oh, I'm no mm. bothering. To be honest, it keeps me out the road of Jack and Victor. I... They're decorating my living room. I know. I was up there earlier. How are they getting on? I could. <laughs> but for God's sake, hurry up. Oh, that's marvellous, you clown, isn't it? Right, you and me going to bloody sponge. Oh, poor Isa. She gonna come home to a flooded, just absolute mess of a flat. Ugh. Poor lady. Jack! Cheers out! Jesus! What the bloody hell has happened in here? I couldn't find a stopcock. Somebody's tailed her. It's the council. They don't know what they're doing. It was a trip. It was a tiny trip. What are you shouting at me for? Do you know what? Stick this up your ass. I'm off. You listen to me, you big. Bastard, you. You're supposed to be painting and decorating in there, and we've not even opened a roll of paper. Jack. You are not going anywhere until you get in there and sort that trouble out. Jack. You get in there, boy, and find that stopcock. Jack! What? Go no. on. Oh, they forgot about the pies. Oh, no, <laughs> bro. Wow. Wow, yo. <coughs> it had been cheaper to pay $160 or pounds, you know? Been a lot cheaper. No, then. No, then. Then you go. <sighs> Oh no. He's gonna record over it, is what's gonna happen. Oh. You bastard! Come on! Right, Delaney's. I tap it Oh no, he's off. gonna. Oh no. <laughs> 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 oh, poor Bobby. Oh, no. <laughs> he broadcasts it to everybody. Holy crap. Oh, it's lovely, boys. <laughs> my hall, my living room, the kitchen. Have you done all this for? Oh, you know what it's like, Isa. Once you get started, you just get... Carried away. Why? Am I not done yet? Come on. Bye. We've had to redo everything. Oh, my bathroom. It's like changing rooms. <laughs> oh, I'll then get Sadie. How many was going to bury us? <laughs> Bro, that was. All right, so th that was um, yeah, they they definitely got in over their heads, and you knew as soon as they said, ah, oh, yeah, he's he's shite, and let's, you knew it was just not going to turn out well. But the fact that Bobby, poor Bobby, oh my God, having his uh. You know his his tape <laughs> broadcast to the world, or at least to the people right there in front of that store. Might as well be the same thing. 
What's funny is the fact that I was like, oh yeah, we've already seen that. We used to show it at parties. I'm like, it's old news. <laughs> the fellas were like, they're years behind apparently on this. Absolutely loved this show. Oh my God. That episode right there is one of the prime examples of why. It's just funny shenanigans. And it's not something that's over the top that's not believable. Like you could see stuff like that actually happening. Like it's not nothing that's jumping the shark or anything. Oh, we're going to take and go to faith. None of that type of stuff. Or, you know, it, it, it's at least believable enough to take and be entertaining. So. Let's get into the next one, shall we? Give yourself peace. It's just another birthday to me. Right, I'll get it when I get it. Okay, if you say so, eh? Honestly. All right, then. Okie dokie. All right. Bye bye. Arsehole. You got your birthday again, eh? Aye. Well, no. He forgets and then he remembers at the last minute, you know, and he's got to pay through the nose to send it special delivery. Why he just can't he post it on time, I don't know. I mean, my birthday's the same day every year. Well, he is sending you something, though, isn't he? Ah, I suppose. What's that? That's Italian. Benito's Tostino. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> and is the red saucio through the Benito's the way we like it? Si, senor. Uh, I can't coast. be happy to get nothing, Jack. Oh, shut up. He always gets you something nice. All right, because it's guilt. All right. He always gets me a good thing, because he's left it late and forgotten. That's his way of making up, you know? Listen to you moaning, you clown, because your son's getting you something smashing on the day you're meant to get it. Uh, I can see why you're getting wound up about it, though. I mean, my Fiona's exactly the same. She's an asshole. She always gets me something lovely. <laughs> <laughs> just ignore me. It's just my age. Right. What do you want today? For what? For what? For your birthday. Ah, give me peace. Oh, come on now, Victor. 75, 75 summers. That's an occasion you've got to mark. My arse. I'll mark it the same as I mark every other day, with a shower, a shit and a shave. <laughs> Classy, eh? Nah, you've got to do something special. Something really good. I mean, what do I normally get you? Bloody bowl of scotch. That's right. And every year I drink it. I look forward to it, too. What's for pudding, by the way? Pudding? Biscotti pinguino. <laughs> nice. Tell you what, give me 75 of them. <laughs> you, you. Jesus. Yes? This chocolate bar. This gave my Justin diarrhea. How do you know it was the chocolate? Cos that's all he had yesterday. He ate it outside the shop and by the time I'd got him home, it shut off his back. Nice. <laughs> Did you have diarrhea? No. I didn't have the chocolate. Do any of we Justin's brothers or sisters have diarrhea? No. They don't have it either. Does anybody else in your immediate family have diarrhea? No. So, we Justin was the only one who ate the chocolate? Aye. Right. I think we might have arrived at the problem here. You see, when you bought your chocolate bar yesterday, it wasn't this size. No, 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 no. It was actually... This size. You give a two-year-old a slab of chocolate the size of a headstone. Jack Gibson has shut up his back to be a death of other chocolate. You give a two-year-old a slab of chocolate the size of a headstone. <laughs> that might do it. That just might do it. Oh, my Lord. I was thinking maybe, just maybe, she accidentally got, you know, like the chocolate laxative or something like that. But woohoo! Good Lord. Looking at the liquors on the back, you got the Midori, and I see the famous grouse, and I don't know what that is or that is, but I've seen that, and I've seen, it looks like Tangeray. I don't, I don't drink alcohol or nothing like that every so often. Take a hike, Johnson, and take shitey ass with you, <laughs> junkie. Customer relations, Naveed. That's the name of the game. Jack, jump. Hey, no, 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 I'll tell you what it is. It's, uh, it's Victor's birthday on Thursday. I know, it's Victor's birthday on Thursday. Because it's Mina's on the Wednesday. So it is, I remember you telling me that, aye. What are you getting her? Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no
Well, actually, no, I'm not going to bother. I normally get him that every year, but no, this is a biggie, you know, he's 75. That's a landmark, it's a milestone, you know, it's a big deal. You're right. Get him two bottles. Oh, no, no, I want to do something good, something special, you know. Oh, aye. I saw a great thing in this magazine. Oh, boy, aye, that is special, aye. Here you go, Victor. Happy birthday. Oh, what's that, Jack? It's a heart attack. Where you go, you dafty? <laughs> heart attack. <laughs> oh, no. Hot air balloon? Oh. That's even more of a heart attack. You're, you're high up in the a air. A balloon? Oh, no, no. Can't you trust a balloon? Who's that? Oh, look at the Hindenburg. It's a Zeppelin, you half-wit. <laughs> it's the same principle, just a different shaped balloon. I mean, you're up there, dying for a smoke, spark up, boof! Happy birthday, Victor. <laughs> you don't talk a lot of pish. The Hindenburg was chock full of flammable gas. Hydrogen. Hydrogen. Thank you, Shug. Your modern balloons don't use that anymore. Very safe. No, the only thing you need to worry about with these balloons is uh, low-flying aircraft. Helicopters. Power lines. Power lines. Good you Tam. Lightning. Church spires. Right, the balloon's humped then. <laughs> oh, here. What about this? Falconry. Become one with Mother Nature and understand the commanding majesty that is the peregrine falcon. Ooh. Falcon? No, that's a nothing starter. Now, a sparrow flew in the living room Monday one time and went away and locked his cell in the toilet. It was a big shite bag. <laughs> <laughs> is that fault, uh... Tandem parachute. What's that? Oh, it looks brilliant. It's a parachute job, but it's safe. I've always wanted to. He's 75, Bobby. They do it for you. You've a guy strapped your back. Is that why you've always wanted to do it? <laughs> anyway, the cheapest adventure there's 150 quid. Oh, there's no joy in that. And an hour perfectly good money, and if somebody else do it all for you. Well, it's thoughtless. Corporate cold. The best gifts are the ones that are thoroughly thought out. Personal touch. Specially fashioned with the recipient in mind. Cheap. Aye, cheap. Well, cheap. <laughs> cheap. Red letter day here, Jack. Local in Craig Lang. A sort of a reddish letter day. A maroon day, if you will. Aye. Stamp yourself to Victor's bank until you can jump off the high flats. <laughs> What's he into? I'm sitting in his arse drinking tea. He's got very, very good at that. What stuff's he into? Well, I was going to get him a book about fishing because he, he gets that trout and salmon magazine out in the Veeds. But it's years since we've done any fishing. We used to fish the Kelvin when we were young boys. Now yeah, we're talking. Chug? Yeah? You still got that dinghy? Aye, I do. Dinghy? A leisurely sail down the Kelvin. Bit of fishing. An urban adventure. Aldi a spread. Mm. Sandwiches nah. Right. Ugh, Jack, that's a lovely idea. Ah, you know. And he doesn't know anything about no, it. No, he doesn't know anything about it, so not a word. As if. <laughs> you might know there is a code to be a dab shelf. Birth, deaths, cheating, drink problems. That's all gossip. The problem is, Victor might not hear about it, but the rest of <laughs> the rest of everybody else will. Well, that's the issue with telling her anything. Surprise birthday presents are secret. Immune. Good. What's keeping you, Jack? Victor, I know something you don't know. Of course. <laughs> Did I say anything about Victor's birthday? No. What's this? Nothing. Does it sound like nothing? It's no nothing. It's a good thing. Oh, you shut your hole. Oh, come on. You know I don't like surprises. What's going on? What's going on? I am sailing. <laughs> I what is this am tape? sailing. One twenty a roll. Bastard, you. <laughs> Thank you, you. <laughs> Doesn't matter, I'll tell you the morning. Oh, by the way, Mina, many happy returns of the day. You may look good, and no one knew you had it, but made a cousin of me. Remember what, Mina? Mira Jenam then. Do Bilkul Bondue. Do Bodai Kamina Banda. Oh. Huh? Huh? You thought I forgot, huh? But I didn't. Now you're the asshole. Get it up, Mina. Happy birthday. He's trying not to take me again. <laughs> <clears throat> morning, good morning. Shot myself there. What's this? 
Uh, nothing. Uh, we called at 9, 10 a.m. That's just new. With a parcel, but you are not in. Please collect it from the depot. What parcel? Uh, the, the one you have to collect. Why have I to collect it? Because... Because you're not in. <laughs> well, I'm in. Can I take a wild guess at what's happened to you, Chris? Aye. It's easier for you to fill out these wee cards than it is to actually do your job and deliver parcels. Aye. Hmm. Now I've got to haul my old ass down to the depot because you're a lazy bastard. Aye. We may cut your no in, saves us some from the parcels. <laughs> <laughs> Damn! Oh, who's done that to you? No me, cos I'm no in. <laughs> now listen to me. It's my birthday today. How many happy returns? Oh, thanks very much. You bring my parcel to the clansman at opening time and I'll no feel the need to call your supervisor. Christ, what have you come as? Happy birthday, Victor. Have you tell them yet, Jack? Back half, Isaac. Can I be a revenge? Shut oh up. I'm telling him. <laughs> right. This outfit has got something to do with what I've got you for your birthday. Guess. You've got me a garden gnome. <laughs> Very funny. No, I'm taking you on a seafaring adventure down the river Kelvin on a dinghy. Right. That'll be great. Will it? Okay, oh, you're not keen. <laughs> what do you mean, an adventure, Jack? Well, not really an adventure. I got a dinghy. Off a shug, you see. And I thought, well, you and I, on the river, throw the hooks into the water like we did when we were kids. Oh, come on, what do you think? What do I think? I think you must have crack in that pipe, Jack. I think you've finally got <laughs> off your rocker. Eh? You and me, in a dinghy on the Kelvin at our age. Are you daft? What's the matter with that? It's not just a stupid idea, you know, Victor. No, no, it's all organised. Come on, it'll be magic. But I've not even got wellies or anything. Organised. How could you not have just got us a bottle of whiskey or something? Go and get your jumper on, Victor. It'll be the best birthday you've ever had. It's the best idea I've ever had. I think it's the worst idea you've ever had. <laughs> Two words. Rat piss. <laughs> rat piss? Aye. Kelvin's full of rats. Where do you think they piss? We rat toilets stationed along the banks of the Kelvin. No, they piss. In the Kelvin. One glug of that, you'll be stone dead. We're not planning to drink the Kelvin, Bobby. <laughs> well, maybe no, but once you've dragged the arse of your wee dinghy or a jaggy shopping trolley, you'll be drinking plenty. That river's manky. It is not. It's clean now. There's trout in that river. Aye. Hard trout. Trout with knives, insects, <laughs> killing midges. Oh, it's full of beasties and creatures. It's the Kelvin, not the Congo. Pete the Jakey claimed he saw a crocodile in it one year. Mind you, that was back when he was injecting absence in his tongue. Bobby's talking shite, lads. It's perfectly safe, especially the bit that you're going on. It, but know this. It's complacency that kills the sailor. The water is a cruel mistress and... That's just what you need to hear is, is all this horrible tales on something that's water-based on a, <laughs> something you've got planned and you're just... I'd like, I want to see the dinghy, to be honest with you, because it, it can either be, you know, like a canoe of some sort or, you know, an actual, like, barely put together floating device, so. Temperamental, too. Disrespect her and she will envelop you. Like, uh, an envelope. <laughs> Happy birthday, Victor. Cheers, son. What's this? Postmark Joe Bird? What is it? It's a broken bottle of malt <laughs> and a whiskey flavoured scarf. <laughs> Hello, Tam. Oh, is that? What's all this? Pork pies there. Eh? Ham sandwiches and steak beaks with a Greg, sir. <laughs> Victor knows nothing about it. It's a lovely thing Jack's done for him. Do you know think, Tam? Aye, oh, aye. Yeah. He's a steak beak. No, you have to wait. It's Victor's day. You're no bust, Minch. Jack says he'll be here at one. One? 
Why is Lewis staring at my head by then? What well, day is? Aye, that's nice, Eric. Right, shoes off. I'm sticking my tootsies right in that water. Lovely here, isn't it? You'd never think it either, right in the heart of the city. It's like paradise. Me and Harry used to come here when we were courting, like. Aye. He used to do that, no? Stuck his feet in the water. Aye. This is where we had our first kiss. Oh, beautiful. What a roasting, but beautiful. Greedy <laughs> <laughs> big Oh, give yourself peace. No, that's a great thing, that. Climb aboard, gentlemen. Get your sea legs, eh? Aye, she's a craft of 22 years. Six years in the service of Her Majesty's Army and 16 years lying in my loft gathering stew. <laughs> she looks sturdy. Aye, aye, aye. It's a belter. Aye, aye, when, when you go, uh, stick to the middle. Keep away from the, the shallows and or the debris around the edges, eh? Eh, that's your oars. And put your life jackets on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Life jackets? Just for safety. Aye, it's all organised. Oh, what? Oh, and speaking of safety, eh, in that bag, there is a flare, just in case. Just in case. Just for safety. It's giving me the fear, this Jack. Oh, no, no. Now, before you uh, push off, uh, should you wish to come ashore anywhere? Just do a wee anchor bend, like, like that. OK? Want to try it, Jack? Yeah, yeah. There you go. Perfect. <laughs> do you want to come with us, Shug? No, 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 no. It's your day. You and him. Besides, I nearly died in this bastard. <laughs> But you'll be fine. Of course they'll be fine. With me at the helm. Oh, <laughs> chase yourself. How? Because it's his birthday, not yours. Oh, come on. I was born to be at sea. I mean, I've got a, a wooden leg and everything. <laughs> There's no room for this <laughs> size as you leg. fat bastard. Right. right. <laughs> I'll just take my gifts back then, will I? A monogrammed hip flask. VM. Victor McDade. That's you. And it's chock full of Johnny Walker tea. Welcome aboard, Boston Ingram. <laughs> you know, since I've started drinking scotches, I haven't had any Johnny Walker. Now, I know it's a blended, right? I know it's a blended scotch, but there probably a lot of people like Johnny Walker. I might take and try some Johnny Walker. I know there's like 14 different colors that, you know, they put in the, you know, they bottle colors and yeah, so. <laughs> My question. Oh, they're getting into rough water now. Uh oh, they're gonna make it. Oh, they can't. It's not rough. <laughs> it does look like it'd be fun and peaceful. Present this is. Hey, you fair out done yourself this time, Jackie boy. I'm sorry I doubted you. Not at all, Victor. You don't have to be hungry, do you? As a matter of fact, I am. Yee-hee! Jack! Victor! Bingo! What's this? Permission to go ashore, sir, for a light lunch and a small embitement. <laughs> <laughs> uh, permission granted. Right, Winston, off your arse, take us in. Uh, all right, right. Happy birthday to you. Happy uh -oh. birthday. Are you coming in? Paddle faster, you wankers, jeez. <laughs> oh, we're trying. Knackered. Uh, come on. What, what have you got there? Steak bakes, pork pies, Beer! Faster! Right, Stink! Right. Here, here, wait a minute. 
Wait! Oh no. Here's an ult. Eric! Oh, oh no, he did a whole damn rope! Throw the food! Throw something! Come on! <laughs> oh no! Throw us the stick, Vex! Oh Jesus! <laughs> Winston got knocked in the head with the bottle. Cussed. We should it. <laughs> Why did you let that bloody flare off? It was an emergency. It's not an emergency, no getting fed, Victor. Right, well, listen to me. I've had no breakfast. I didn't even get a bite of my roll before you dragged me out. I've had no breakfast. I could eat a scabby horse. Oh, I've had a couple of snips of bacon and a sausage and a black pudding and an egg <laughs> and some fried toast, I know. And I thought he's gone. Oh, I beans and mushrooms. Shut up! <laughs> I've seen double. It's four of you in this boat. Hey, right, what are we doing now, eh, Mr. Organization? I don't know. Where are we? Oh, uh, it's not so bonny down here. No. Aye. This is a bad part of the river. Is that the Park Mill Flats? Oh, Jesus. We're not in Park Mill, are we? Apache country. What the hell was that? Calm down. Probably just a Ned or something. Oh, I don't like this, Jack. It's turning sour. <laughs> I want out the boat. Never get out the boat. Absolutely goddamn right. Aye, right, well, I want out. Even if there was a place to get out the boat. Or Park Mill. I mean, this place is twinned with a Gaza Strip. I'm telling you, get out the boat, you get flayed. Aye, right, Jack's right. The last time I was stupid enough to come through here, I got beat up by a six-year-old. <laughs> <laughs> Beat up that six year old. Here we go. Oh, feel it like bastards. Ah, you're losing your melon. Scared for a couple of kids. How do you know? See, there you are. Duck! What? Oh. Duck! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Yo! We're under attack! If I ever get off this boat, Jack, I'm going to slit your bastard in throat! Just stay low! Right, oh. Oh, Winston, he's getting beat up. What's that noise? What noise? It's, it's oh, now really it's about to take and get rough. Water. Falling. <laughs> yeah. That's exactly a little water falling. Oh, a paddle! Jesus. Quickly now. Come on. Oh, my God. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, this is not what they had, what Jack had planned, I'm sure. That's a good laugh, isn't it? In here, this old days. Oh, some buff to this. Soaking, starving, lost. See you, Victor. You are one torn faced bastard. You have been moaning since we hit the water this morning. Come here. Turn your you bad man! You're scaring me, Beetle, aren't you, hey? Oh, get up, my scarf! Uh, I've had enough of you, you prick! Get off me! Where's the cameras? Huh? Let me see your hand! <laughs> Back off! <laughs> You're turning into a loony. That's what Bobby said. It's a rat piss thing. You've took a mouth of that and you've been off your bloody nut! I'm not a loony. You're the loony. What are you doing for Winston's birthday, eh? A firing squad! Sign me up for that, Jack! Anything but this! <clears throat> Meat and drink, fellas. Wait, what? I would have them again. Ah, uh, prawn cocktail. That's a first for me. How was yours? Oh, yeah. My, uh, tomato ketchup flavoured crisps were right on the money. <laughs> I had a packet of Starburst. A Mars bar, an even half dozen of fondant bananas. I'm about to have a paparami for my pudding. Oh!
<laughs> oh, Winston got two big old whelps on his head. Yeah, <laughs> you know what? See, despite having these two bollocks in my forehead, it's a good day. Uh, <clears throat> sorry about that wee outburst earlier on, Jack. I was forgotten about Victor Boy. You know what this is like? You know that movie with the boy with the big tash? What do you call it? Smokey and the Bandit? How was this like Smokey and the Bandit? What? No, 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 no. The one where they go down the river on the canoe. Deliverance. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was a good movie, that, eh? They do something to get pumped in that, didn't they? <laughs> right. What the deliverance? You haven't you organised that for us as well, have you, Jack? <laughs> <laughs> See, if it was that movie, you'd be the one to get pumped, Jack. How would that be? Because it's the wee fat one that gets pumped in deliverance, isn't it? Victor can be Burt Reynolds, it's his birthday. Ooh, I like that. Yeah. That makes you the ugly half-witted bastard that plays a the banjo then, didn't it? <laughs> you enjoyed your bus dinner? Oh, aye. One of the best. So there's another can over, will you, Winston? What? Oh, no, there's none left. I wonder who that carry out belonged to. Oh! Oh, Jesus. Back to the boat. <laughs> no, 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 this way! In the boat, you diddy! Oh, Christ! Oh, my God! Yeah. Ha. <laughs> Yous are dead. They will look dead. That was our picnic, your dicks. These were beer. We drank it all, and it was delicious. Stop that, dude. You're just annoying them. Do you know what we've got to do, Yous? No. Oh, see if you have it. I'll try and play it. <laughs> oh, no. Oh. Where are we now? We're home and dry, boys. Just round this bend, here's the Clyde. I used to work it. Aye, there's a slipway there. We can paddle up to that, jump on it, and we can get a bus right up the road. Stick. Oh, here, what about the boat? Oh, aye. Well, we could take our time and let all the air out it, roll it up flat, and then the three of us could hump it up the road, drip and wet. Or we could just say it bust and sank. Boston sank. Yeah. It's a shame, though, isn't it? Yeah, unfortunate. <laughs> uh. <laughs> what a day. No offence, Jack, but I'm glad it's done. Yeah. It's no done yet. Oh, Jesus. Is that a uh, telly? Oh, no. You shouldn't have drunk your beer. We're sorry. We're pensioners. It's my birthday today. Oh, happy birthday. We've all clubbed together and got your telly. Oh. Shit! No, no, that's the best thing remember! Just keep going! That's the slip way! Oh! 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 you again? 75, son. Magic, man. Good age. My granddad's 75 next week. All right. Aye. Don't know what to get him. Whiskey. Whiskey. <laughs> <laughs> that was quick, fast, and in a hurry. Whiskey. Leave Winston. Looks like they left Winston. Oh no. Oh Jesus, what a heat.
He's going to be on a boat halfway to somewhere. Yep, you can hear the seagulls. <laughs> oh my God, this show. Absolutely too funny sometimes, man. It just, you know, you get the sentiment, want to take and do something that's, you know, heartfelt and it's, you know, personalized and it's not, you know, just run of the mill like you do all the time. 75 being, you know, that'd be like platinum anniversary you know if you're married like 75 is like platinum anniversary or some crap like that if i'm not mistaken i can't remember but you know it's it's a momentous occasion turning 75 years old and the fact that you know he wanted to you know take them take it back to whenever they were younger and you know go down the river and do some fishing and everything like that things didn't quite turn out how they wanted to but oh my goodness and poor winston getting plopped in the head twice with a bottle and I don't know what was being thrown at him, but it definitely left a mark. And of course, Winston, he, it just completely, he always gets the short end of the stick, it seems like. <laughs> so, I absolutely love this. I hope you all enjoyed this. Y'all be good to each other. Love yourselves. Peace.